Okay, folks. So I figured today, as I'm relaxing on this Sunday evening, I just wanted to cover a little bit about the markets here on this beautiful day in Tampa, Florida. It's about 70 degrees, beautiful sun. Just relaxing again in the hot tub before I start checking out the charts again tonight. And I wanted to just discuss a little bit about what I'm looking for in the market this week. And number one, you have to understand the S&P closed above 1500. So that's the biggest thing. That coupled with the fact that the NBC Nightly News highlight the stock market and the run it's had and the average investor's lust to get back in, those two factors will yield further inflows of money this week. I do think though, however, the market will top, top out this week, all right? So be ready for that, folks. Again, it's not gonna be a violent top out with a big drop, but I do believe you'll stall out and then start to come back in. And again, in saying that, what you're gonna look for is obviously the markets to hit a high anywhere between the 152 and the 150 level on the SPY, all right? And that's the S&P tracking ETF. So really between 1500 and 1520, you should see a top out this week. And then the markets again, will start to slowly roll over, gaining a little more momentum on the way down. Now the key to look at key plays here is to understand you need to find the technical PPT strategy levels. And again, PPT stands for price, pattern, and time. And again, if you can find charts that dictate levels hit this week, they are absolute short scenarios and plays you can short, all right? So again, that's what I'm gonna be looking for this week. Key stocks like Chevron and Gap fill around 117.35 to 40. Uh, the Yen FXY, if it gets down to about the 104.50 level is gonna be a great level. You have other stocks like even Apple. Apple PPT proprietary level, $420 approximately. That's gonna be a fantastic level to look for. All right, so again, I'm just brainstorming as I'm relaxing here on this Sunday afternoon as the sun's getting ready to set. And I'm already what I'm doing is trying to think of the setups this week. And again, if you're an analyst in the market, if you're a trader, if you're an investor, you must constantly be thinking about the next trade setups. What you need to be is the first one in the door so you get the best entry price. And again, by utilizing the PPT strategies, these proprietary strategies we've developed, you can figure out the exact price point where a stock or a market will start to turn down or up. In this case this week, again, some stocks are now extremely extended. Even 3M, look at the chart of 3M. Not one candle red since the new year. Extremely extended, I'll have a master level put out inside the research center, which again has a free trial to it. So again, if you wanna check us out, come to inthemoneystocks.com and take the seven day free trial to the research center. And that's if you're an investor or a trader or even a swing trader. You wanna get involved in the market, you wanna profit with an 80 to 90% success rate, that's how you do it. All right guys, on that note, I'm gonna bid you all farewell and we're gonna get on with things.